I do want to bring in now, though, Courtney Dominguez, Payne Capital Senior Wealth Advisor. I'm not a affiliated with the, the Payne Group. Uh, Courtney, again, you know, I, I thought it was interesting because you have a, a variety of, uh, oper of ways that this economy could come back. You know, of course, mm -hmm. the best will be a V-shaped recovery. Most people are discounting that. Most, most of these professional money managers say, are saying a U-shape, in other words, a gradual return. Let's, I want to get your idea of how we come back, but more importantly, people are watching this to say, how should their portfolios be positioned? Because I think portfolios are going to look a lot different in the future than they did in January and February. Very much so. And I think we just really need to look at this and understand that we are getting a lot of bad data coming out. And I know we've kind of alluded to that. Of there will be some negative news, but we need to separate the fact that there's going to be news showing how the economy is doing and how the stock markets are doing. The stock markets have already discounted most of that information. And so we want to make sure that we're taking advantage of these things because the markets are not going to wait for clarity in the data to happen. They are going to bounce a lot sooner. Right. The question is whether that's already right. happened. But I think there are a lot of optimistic signs. They're not reacting quite as much to every single data point. Actually, I see that as a really positive sign that we're just making sure everyone has the position to just take advantage of these dips as they happen. And you don't want to wait too long for well, maybe and, there's and another thing to happen.